Hello guys, welcome back to my another After Effects tutorial, in this tutorial, we are going to see, how to make smoke text, or title animation in After Effects. You can see the preview playing in the background. You can use this title animation as introduction title, as a lower third or as logo reveal, so now open After Effects and let's start creating it. Now create a new composition. Name it as Smoke Text. For this composition set the time duration to 5 seconds. Here you can add any text you want, or you can add your logo. If you want to make this as a logo reveal animation, for this demonstration, I will add the text as animation. Here you can use any font and font style. Here I am using Biba's new font. Now let's align our text to center. Now select the text layer. Here we will pre-compose our text layer. Name it as text. Now let's start animating our text. Now in effects and preset search for wave warp. Now add it to the text composition. Make sure you are at the start of the timeline. Now create a keyframe for wave height. Now change wave height value to 190. Now go at 2 seconds and 15 frames. Change wave height value to 0. Now go at 3 seconds. Now press U to view created keyframes. Now again create a keyframe for wave height. Now go at end of the timeline. Now change wave height value to 50. Now change wave width value to 95. Now change direction angle to 45 degree. Change wave speed to 0.03. Now select all created keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now we need to adjust the speed graph, adjust the speed graph as shown. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now again add the wave warp effect. Now for wave warp 2. Create a keyframe for wave height. Change wave height value to 150. Now go to 2 seconds and 15 frames. Now change the wave height value to 1. Now go at 3 seconds. Now create another keyframe for wave height. Now go at end of the timeline. Change wave height value to 50. Now select all created keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now we need to adjust the speed graph. Adjust the speed graph as shown. Now change wave width value to 140. Change the direction to minus 45 degree. Now change wave speed to 0.3. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Now in effects and preset search for fast blur. Add it to the text composition. Make sure you are at the start of the timeline. Now create a keyframe for the blurriness. Now change blurriness value to 40. Now go at 2 seconds and 15 frames. Change blurriness value to 0. Now press U to view created keyframes. 
Now go at 3 seconds. Create another keyframe for the blurriness. Now go at the end of the timeline. Change blurriness value to 25. Now select all created keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now we need to adjust the speed graph. Adjust the speed graph as shown. Now in effects control panel, position the fast blur above the wave warp effect. Now in effects and preset search for glow. Add it to the text composition. Now this will add the glow effect to our text. Now press T to bring up the opacity. At the start of the timeline, create a keyframe for opacity. Now change opacity value to zero. Now go at two second. Change opacity value to 100. Now go at 3 second. Create another keyframe for opacity. Now go at the end of the timeline. Change opacity value to 0. Now select all created keyframes. Change keyframe assistant to easy ease. Now we need to adjust the speed graph. Adjust the speed graph as shown. Now let's see the preview. Perfect. Here our smoke text animation is complete. Thank you guys for watching this tutorial, see you on next Friday with another tutorial. Thank you.